Oh, she's in bed, baby. She's still sick. Who's going to drive me? I'll drive you this morning. What, I can't drive you? You always swear at all the other drivers, though. I do not. Yes, you do. You always yell at them and call them what he were. Oh, well, I won't. I'll be a good boy. Breakfast? Some toast. We'll have to eat it on the way. We are running very late. Lunch? Making your sandwich now. Choosing Vegemite. I don't have Vegemite. Oh, he doesn't like Vegemite. Ah. Now I'm going to give you some money for lunch. Right? This is fine. Some apples and white. Really? Oh, now you want me to drive it, huh? Get the fuck away from the body. Slowly put your hands behind your head and interlock your fingers. Jackson Michael, you are under arrest for the murder of Travis Burford. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you do or say can and will be taken down by me in writing and later tendered against you in court. Do you understand? Shit just got real, huh? Thank you, Chris Davies. I'm here to ask you a few questions. You damn sure they have the answers. It's gonna be a long night. Think I can get you? Yeah, I'd love a cigarette. Don't smoke it. That's why I asked. Okay, tough guy. Fuck the small talk. Why you call those people? What was it? Daddy was a drunk? Mother abandoned you? 
teased at school. So the poor little boy grows up to be a serial killer, right? Oh no, that's right. Jackson Mike, different type of serial killer. Serial killer that only goes after criminals, right? When does killing one person make you a serial killer? Kidding me, right? One person? Explain something to me. If you only kill the one person, why the fuck do all these bodies have the same exact ammo as the body we found you with? I didn't kill these people. But you killed Travis Buford, right? We caught you kneeling above his body, staring down at him like some fucking psycho. It doesn't mean I killed him. No shit, it doesn't. You wanted him dead. You said as soon as he sees the light of day, that'll be his last. You damn right I wanted him dead. He took my little girl. He deserved to die. Well, he did not talk. What was it? The confession. I think you're mistaken, Detective. I said he deserved to die. I never said that I killed him. You motherfucker! You think you're better than me, huh? Is that what you think? You a fucking killer! You ain't better than shit! Hey! Relax, Davies! Cool off! Take a walk! Cool you gotta off. be real fucking proud of a daddy! You go! You sit. It's it over, motherfucker! You okay? Unfortunately, Davies was right. You can't smoke in here. But I, uh, I brought you this instead. It's the best I could do. Thanks. I'll pass. Yeah. Anything else I can get you? Water? Coffee? Well, if you need anything, just let me know. Wow. I thought that was only in the movies. Does that actually work? Says what work? Oh, the whole good cop, bad cop thing. <laughs> You'd be surprised. You can save it for somebody else. Okay. How about we be straight with each other instead? You first. Okay, well, I think you killed Travis Burford. Well, you're wrong. I hope I am. But you need to help me improving that. What's the point? Huh? No one's going to believe me. I've got motive, right? Look, personally, I don't think there are going to be many people missing Travis. He was a low-life scumbag that had it coming to him, right? I get it. You killing him out of credence? After what he did to your little girl? And to walk free on a technicality? That's not justice. So you went after him. Since Travis in other countries, they still believe in the death penalty for what you did to my daughter. But here, all you need is a slap on the wrist. You know how the lethal injection works, Travis? How it's a three drug cocktail. You see, the first is a sedative that's used to put the prisoner to sleep. And second, no, usually there's something along the line that sucks him into anyone. That's what you're feeling right now, Travis. Looks at Saxon more. You feel weak. I have it on earth. Your body feels heavy, like it's made from muscles in your diaphragm. 
See, Travis, I haven't given you the first drug. Because I want you to be awake for this. See, the unthinkable things you've done can never be forgiven, nor can they be forgotten. And I know that by killing you won't bring my daughter back. Will stop you from doing it to anyone else's child. I'm gonna give you the chance. You never gave my daughter. I'm gonna make this quick and easy for you. I feel some tightness around your chest. So easy in the heart. And then you put the blindfold over his eyes. Something about sending a message like blind justice. Is that how it happened? Yes. It's exactly how it happened. 